Earwax, Brownsville, Texas. They're going to get some rain at noon Eastern time, so be careful there. Hey, Madonna's going to join us when we come right back after a break. Yes! And if you've ever been told you look like somebody famous, like our stage manager, I think looks like Deborah Winger, we have a way you can make some money looking like somebody famous. Yeah, Juliet looks like, well, <laughs> JoJo the Wonder Dog. Oh, man. <laughs> no, coming right back. Madonna. Christy Brantley. So has anyone ever told you you look like someone famous? It's yeah. Who? I get Mel Gibson all the oh, time. Or Brad Pitt. Yeah, sure. And I then he woke up, folks. All right, so if so, you put that star-studded appearance to good use. Listen to me. Listen to our next guest, actually. In Los Angeles, Denise Bella. There she is right in the middle. Oh, she looks fabulous in her beret. Hi, Madonna. She's the Hi, author wow. of... Good morning. You've got the look. You do have the look today, Denise. The complete... I, I hear you've got the look, too. Oh, there's no question. The complete how-to celebrity look-alike guide, and she is boined, uh, joined by some of her look-alikes. Cool. Now, do you have to kind yeah, of look guys. like the, the star oh, in the first place? Hello. Do you have to have a general look of the star? Well, there's um, different kinds of jobs for different people. You've got the dead ringer lookalikes. Right. And then you've got performers like me and Elvis. And, um, <laughs> Jerry Lewis. <laughs> that you can actually put it on a little bit more. Light age. We actually have uh, another lookalike in our studio. Marilyn, Hi. obviously. Hello. Hi. How are you? Thank you very much Hi, for being Marilyn. here. I want to thank you so much for having me. Well, be careful about this guy sitting next to you. What are you really? talking about? Trouble. Are, are you trouble? Do you need an extra pillow? For your, no, I have not. plenty of pillows, honey. Uh, I thought honey. so, yes. In all, in all seriousness, <laughs> give, us, give us an idea about how lucrative this business can be, because, because uh, Denise was saying this is an untapped business. Well, it is, and I think Denise will testify to the fact that it depends on what you want to do. There are those yeah. hardcore lookalikes that really think they're the star, which kind of scared me, to be frank with you. <laughs> but they, they live and breathe the star star every day and then there are, are people that get those weekend jobs the birthday parties yep. the corporate affairs that are a lot of fun and you get to bring a lot of fun to events that's kind of like my speed you know I work maybe three times a week as Marilyn mm. and, and bring a little joy to the world and it's a lot of fun how, lot do, you of fun. Find, how do you find these people Denise uh, they find uh, me mm -hmm. they always find they find me actually really yeah, I've um, I've been a Madonna impersonator for 18 years. So mm -hmm. and so they just the come up is, and talk to you and, and find out how you got into it and how much money they, they can me make. On the I internet. guess. Yeah, exactly. I get a lot of emails every day saying, "Hey, I look like so and so. How do I get started in the biz?" Yeah. Now Anna Nicole, uh, boy, a pretty dead ringer there. No question. Was, she, she's great. great. Huh? Perfect. Uh, smart Anna Nicole. <laughs> wow, she's good. She's very smart. See what I mean? Wow. Tell me a story that, uh, that's intriguing to you that where someone may have uh, mistook you for the real thing. Anna or me? Are you? Huh? Um, <laughs> I have a lot of interesting stories like that, but I think mostly um, if I'm filming or if I'm on the street, people will assume that I'm her. Mm -hmm. But um, well, you, you I guys I, could really. I mean, at least for the stars that are that are being impersonated that are still with us. I mean, you could really get some cool stuff out of that. You know, getting into nightclubs and so forth. I know Anna probably likes that. She definitely. <laughs> I get mobbed. She gets mobbed because uh, Anna Nicole is very hot right now. So. Well, Denise, uh, why do I mean? There's a whole book on this. So if we uh, if we do kind of look like somebody, like I do look like kind of like Brad Pitt. There's no I mean. There's no I question. Oh yeah, like I look like Denzel Washington. Give me a break. <laughs> okay, well maybe not close. Uh, how do you get booked then? What's the key to getting um, booked? Yeah, well, first, before you get booked, you want to um, buy my book because it'll um, guide you into every step that you need to learn to become a professional lookalike. And then I would say um, I'm an agent, so look me up. Exactly. Who's the number one request right now? Is it Madonna? Marilyn Monroe. Oh, really? She's number one. Uh, uh, so that's why she's with us. Happy birthday to Michael. Still to this what day. Is it? It's Michael's birthday. Oh, I'd love to sing Happy Birthday to Michael. Is he here? This well, is that would be me. Oh, yes, See, you. Uh, you thought I was that Brad. That a lot of people. You keep calling me Brad. No, I'm Michael. Go ahead, sing. Happy Thanks, birthday. Denise. Birthday. <laughs> To you, Marilyn, sing well, happy birthday <laughs> to you. <laughs> happy birthday. We want to cause some controversy. Mr. I'm going to need that book. <laughs> celebrating a birthday. I <laughs> can't even remember your name. Happy Michael. birthday to you. <laughs> Night -night, wow. Michael. Very good, happy Marilyn. Birthday. Thank you, Marilyn. Thank you, ladies. Oh. Oh, guys. Oh, oh, you're fresh. Good job. <laughs> We'll be back we'll be with back. more <laughs> after this. We'll be back in two. Oh,
and friends. gets on the program because it makes us feel like we're, you know, playing major